2023. We are at the Montague. Look at this thing. So this is an 88. What is it? It looks mysterious. It's a Honda. A Honda? An 88 That's Honda. I've heard of those. Going good. Battery's good now. 
And a fuel injection sometimes it takes like. Yeah. Oh. Is it charging while you're riding? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I still don't know why I did that. It's one of those things where like they eliminated kickstarts and say, wait, like, I need them. Yeah, yeah. Well, cool. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. They, they left. That must have been the image we saw earlier. Yeah. Oh, yeah, coming around, come up Timberline. Timber, Timber View. I don't think so. How's Ryan doing? Yeah. Things are much better than last year. Look at your freaking fender. <laughs> That's hilarious. Was this a slip on? <laughs> Friction fit? Fender mounts for this. I just put on the four holes for the front fender support. There you go. So I stuck that in there to kind of widen it out a little bit. That looks great. How's the speed? I'm on it. I'm going pretty good, so I don't think I'd be going any faster than that. So. Okay. Oh, that was good. I, uh, I forgot I had it here. So there you go. I found it. It's good to find that every once in a while. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> All right.
everything's good. Looking pretty good. Well, I was we're, down, yeah. How, how, how far were you into your last year? I was in six for a lot of that. Yeah. I was just dri dribbling.
Nerd 2023. We are at the Montague. Look at this thing. What's he doing? We got side by sides. We got a couple dirt bikes. We got a couple dummies on three wheelers. Don't they know these things are dangerous? Hey, you look like Jeff Mahar. Hey, how's it going? Hey, man. I'm just trying to get out. Are you with these people? Oh. These these weirdos on three wheelers? We were honking. We're on the old Rector Road. We're on the Rector Road, and you can recite any uh, funny thing you want to say about that. Rector, I barely know her! <laughs> I don't know where that goes, never been that way. Montague in. Lots of people, there's something up there. There's a 350X up there, we might need to go investigate. There's a 350X up here, I might need to investigate. So we're not allowed to go that way. There's a, a lot of trails blocked off that would normally be open because uh, there's like no snow. It's not crazy dusty, but as the day wears on and it dries out, I'm sure it's gonna be dustier and dustier. Thankfully, the saving grace has been that, that it's been windy. So, nice 350X up here. We need to check this out, investigate, see if it's a buddy of ours. Not that I know, I don't recognize anything here. Nice 85s, rocking the same 702s that I am. I like that front tire. I don't know if we get stamped in here. Derek's on a mission. Derek Walters, you might know. My, my trike test buddy. I think he's going to the restroom. The old moose knuckle. Serving some food. I don't know what the general consensus is. I do need to get stamped. Here's Cousin Pete wandering in. Just wanted to get the lay of the land. What do you think, Pete? Awesome, buddy. Did awesome. you see that 350X? I did. I don't, I don't recognize. He's got the same PV702s on the back that I got. They're registered. Some people say you can't register a three-wheeler, but they don't know. <laughs> I followed Derek over here. I think he's just in line for the the restroom. I'm going to shut this off, I think. Any parting words? Alright. Rubber side down. There you go. Okay. Potty break has been completed at the Montague. Got my buddy Ed and Frank here. My other buddy Ryan Jenks and Doug Pete of the Pottersville Pete's say that I don't know can I say that sure. I'll edit that out if you want me to so you guys have that moss right yep knew it so you've seen Ryan's machine you've seen Doug's machine cousin Pete totally different Pete is here he's got the Rincon 650 still running good no complaints this is uh, Jeff Mahar's 350X, 85, made up to look like an 86. You'll remember this from the uh, the video I did where I went and bought some nice maple planks from him. He had the over Fender 350X. Eric James Johnson is making another another appearance. I'm the one who knows how to balance. That, I don't think last year I told the story. Okay, and I'll, I'll get you as I tell it. So, it was probably 1994. You and I were riding double on my dad's big red 84 200DS. <laughs> yep. We had just left the road that I, I live on currently. We started out down towards the golf course. And uh, you, you kind of like came up to my ear and you said, you need something faster. <laughs> and I looked, I looked back at you like what the frig is he talking about this is a 1984 200 es this is like this is it. height of technology 
got reversed. And you said, my brother Matt says 250R is like the fastest three wheeler Honda ever made. And you told me about, I don't know if you had a camp on Sacandaga Heights or yeah, down that way. And the, the dudes are ripping you know, yeah. And I was like, huh. 250R. I'll file that away for a rainy day. It's a good thing you kept. It's a good thing you took that advice. So over. it's it's basically all your fault, Johnson. I get it. I yep. Get it. But I've known Eric since first grade. I've known you longer. I mean, it's not much longer than first grade, but kindergarten, yeah. But I think the first time we hung out was first grade. Yeah. And my my, my mom I said. Shot him in the eye with a rubber band. And you did bag. in the locker room, you jerk. I wanted to cry, but I didn't. But this is Eric's CRF. 450 RX, not not the 450 R. Don't get confused. RX. What's this? What's different about this? The top end or the bottom GNCC end? Or CC ready, so it's race ready for uh, cross country racing. Smaller okay. rear tire and mandatory kickstand for regulation. Other than wow. that, it's, it's wow. Like I hadn't even noticed the kickstand. So that's that's an option on other bikes. It has to be there. Wow. This is amazing, Eric. Okay, thanks. Having fun here. Yep. Thanks. There's lots of stories that start with one night Eric and I were doing this. <laughs> this is Derek's uh, 85 350X. Derek Walters, you remember him from many Trike Fest videos, parade videos, all the things. Who else we got? We got Dave Esselin. So these are guys all from my, my hometown. I've known Eric forever. I, I haven't known Dave forever because they moved up from New Jersey. Hey, hey, no. what, hey, what year did you move up from New Jersey? Eighty-eight, the same year as that. Eighty-eight. Oh man, perfect segue. Yeah. This, so this is an eighty-eight. What is it? It looks mysterious. It's a Honda. A Honda, an eighty-eight two, Honda. Two strokes. I've heard of those. So it's a. Uh, Nineteen eighty-eight Honda two hundred fifty R. Did you say you had a hard time keeping up? In this last road here, we went on. I can use a little taller gearing. Okay. And uh, but I'm having a good time. Okay. It's all right. Now she's burned. I'm I'm excited you're here, Dave. I'm excited to be here. So, have right. you checked your gas level? It's getting down there. Okay. She's, okay. She's, she's, she's right. Right. She's drinking the gas. They got a gas in the pumper. Okay. This is Jay Beck. His lovely wife Monica. Monica again the with the uh, charcuterie containers. I don't know, can we call this a board? It might be charcuterie containers. This is great. This is... I know. Yeah. We should have grapes, too. You know what, sir? Sir 2024 would have olives and chocolate. Okay. I'm going to Nice. Jay, tell me about your Honda. My Honda? Yeah. 2015 Foreman. Keeps up with everybody. Foreman. What size is the motor? 499. 499. That's almost 500. Almost 500, yeah. That's that's nice. That's the way Honda does that. It's weird. Outdoor Motorsports. Yep. Formerly, what was it formerly? Herba. Herba Honda, where many a Honda was yeah. bought from my family. Yep. Well. Miss that place, that family. Good family, the Herbas. Yes, I agree. I agree. I bought many a Nissan from the Herbas too, Monica. Did you know that? Yep. Well, we're gonna wind this down so we can finish our beverages and get underway. Cheers. Okay, leaving Montague. We've got a side by side that's supposed to be in our group. He's gonna come catch us. So he says, Kemper. Will this start in one kick? Let's see. Let's see. All right. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, that's right. That's right, Jeff. Look at this technique. Okay, it works. I mean, if it works for you, then do it. Everybody's ready. Side by sides, but everybody's excited about the trikes. Can we go or what? What's the deal?
Everybody, everybody ready? I saw some 350X pushing going on. Yes, look at that, that's how you do it. Derek, uh, Derek had a, a low tire. Looks like he's paying right now. Can't zoom in on him. There he is. Slip him 100, Derek. There he is, that was 100, 200s. Wow, super generous. Yep. That's how you do it. You know, you treat these people right, they treat you right. So, it looks like we're back on their way. I had enough time to go to the bathroom. Derek has spied me. First kick. You ate 260 and you're on a 350X. There it is. Fourth kick, maybe. All right. Let's send this on north.
another friend. I've been trying to keep up with all day. For skick. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Pull my pants up. So from here, we got to go back. After we left Montague, there was a T intersection. We can scoot down and take a little bit different way back to Flat Rock, Flat Rock Road. So we'll do that. Probably have another beer at Flat Rock. Doug's going to need it. And, uh, and then we'll go on to Timberview because that's on the way. And then we'll check our mileage. And if, if some people want to peel off, they can. Because I think we'll go right by the turn, which takes us back to Snow Ridge. Or you can go down to Barrows or whatever it's called and get a couple extra miles in. I, yeah, I'd like to hit it. I don't know that we will. It's, yeah. Like I said, right now we're uh, 28.7 miles. That can't be right. From the beginning? Dang. Well, not from the very beginning. Where you told me you didn't turn your GoPro on that first time. So yeah. it might be another mile or two. Yeah. Yeah.
All right. Let's get this pig washed.